All right, now China's coronavirus outbreak is showing no signs of abating. In the latest news that is coming in, the death toll has now reached 811, surpassing the fatalities in the SARS outbreak of 2002-2003. The numbers of confirmed cases have reached a whopping 37,198 so far, with 2,600 new cases being reported in just the last 24 hours. Meanwhile, France has announced five new cases of the coronavirus infection within its territory, and this has taken the total number of those infected in France to 11. The Prime Minister Eduardo Felipe has called for an emergency meeting following the new cases. And the five new cases are British citizens who are said to be holidaying in France. And these people were staying in the same ski resort where an infected Singapore national had stayed. And also the U.S. Embassy has reported the first American fatality in the ongoing outbreak, a 60-year-old woman who was being treated at a hospital in Wuhan has succumbed to her novel coronavirus infection. And Hong Kong's chief executive, Carrie Lam, has said that the territory is now facing an acute shortage of masks and other preventive medical care. She said that Hong Kong did not have enough masks to keep up with the supply for over a month. And also in a new study in the Journal of the American Medical Association, scientists have hinted the possibility of the coronavirus being transmitted via fecal matter. Now it's being said that nearly about 10% of the patients who were brought in for the coronavirus infection symptoms also suffered symptoms of diarrhea and nausea before they were admitted. It's also important to note that SARS infection displayed a very similar character back in the year 2003 and the novel coronavirus belongs to the same family as SARS.